click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, in today's video, we are going to see what is crystal oscillator, where it is used, what are the different materials that used in the construction of crystal oscillator and how it works. So let's begin with the topic. Crystal oscillator are basically a type of sinusoidal oscillator and they are used to produce sine wave at the output. The crystal oscillators are used in the application where high frequency stability is important. Crystal oscillator uses piezoelectric crystal as a resonant tank circuit. So we can say it is basically a tuned circuit oscillator only. The crystal oscillator uses quartz crystal for the construction of crystal oscillator. They are used to provide highly stabilized and accurate signal at the output. Therefore, they are used in the applications such as communication transmitter, digital clock, watches. So these are the basically the application where frequency stability and accuracy of the output is important. The crystal oscillators are basically used to provide frequency ranges up to 10 megahertz. Now, for the construction of crystal oscillator, a material used which is called as quartz crystal. Quartz crystal having a property of piezoelectric effect. So first see what is piezoelectric effect. So according to this effect, if the AC signal is applied across a quad crystal, then it starts producing vibrations. The frequency of vibration is approximately equal to the frequency of applied AC input signal. Similarly, if we apply mechanical vibrations to the crystal, then it produces AC voltage at the output. And the output voltage frequency is now equal to the applied vibration frequency. So in this way, the crystal oscillator can produce vibrations as well as AC voltage at the output. This effect is called as piezoelectric effect. So the quartz material is basically used to exhibit this effect. Other than quartz material, the other materials which are used as for construction of crystal oscillator are nothing but Rachel salt and tourmaline. But the most commonly used crystal oscillator material is a quartz crystal because it is inexpensive and it is easily available. Another reason is that its property lies between those of tourmaline and rachel salt. That's why quartz crystal is most commonly used material for the construction of crystal oscillator. Now let's see how it looks and how we can obtain the crystal oscillator out of that. So for that we need to consider some diagrams. So the natural shape of quad crystal is like a hexagonal and pyramids present on the top and bottom. So in order to get crystal out of that we need to rectangularly cut the slab to get crystal out of it. So there are different cuts by using which we can get a rectangular slab. The different types of cut are X cut, Y cut, XY cut, AT cut. So based on what type of cut we are using, the characteristics of the crystal oscillator also get changes. The various parameters that get affected by the cutting of rectangular slab are nothing but temperature coefficient, frequency of oscillation, resonant frequency and many more. So after cutting, the rectangular slab structure is looks like this. But in order to mount the slab into the electronic circuit or in order to use the crystal oscillator in an elect electronic circuit, we need to use it in the assembled form. So the rectangular slab is get connected between the two metal plates and housed in a package. And that entire thing is considered as a crystal oscillator. So whatever voltage is applied across crystal oscillator is appears in the form of mechanical vibrations at the output. And the output frequency of vibration is now similar to the applied AC input voltage. The frequency at which the maximum vibrations produced by the crystal oscillator is called as resonant frequency. The frequency range that can be provided by crystal oscillator ranges from 15 kilohertz to 10 megahertz. The frequency above 10 megahertz do not provide any signal at the output. Therefore, the range is restricted from 50 kilohertz to 10 megahertz. So this is what about the crystal oscillator. The material used for the construction of crystal oscillator are quartz crystal, rachel salt and tourmaline. But the most common material is quartz crystal because it has properties of both as well as it is inexpensive. At the same time, it exhibits a property of piezoelectric effect. Piezoelectric effect is nothing but when 
AC input voltage is applied across crystal, it produces output frequency and if the output frequency or mechanical vibration is applied, then it produces AC signal at the output. This is also called as transducer and inverse transducer effect or piezoelectric effect. So this is what about the crystal oscillator, materials used for crystal oscillator and how we can use crystal oscillator in the circuit. So I hope you understand this topic. So thank you very much for watching this video. Stay tuned to Ikira. Subscribe Ikira. Thank you.